Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening. Rafael, and good evening, Rosa. Good evening. And have, uh, my name is Ruth Hernandez, and I will be your uh, English tutor. Nice uh, to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Um, have you already started in your platform? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, just Good. remember that you can do if you want all the material in a week, it's no problem. Okay, but okay. you will all, all we will always be here uh, reinforcing what you have seen and we will be covering it like um, in a schedule. We will be seeing the first two uh, lessons uh, during the first week. Then in the second week, we will uh, be seeing the third one. Mm -hmm. And in the third week, we will be developing the fourth with the midterm exam. And so we will be finishing in the, the fourth week with the five lessons, okay? Okay. And this is me. In my name, Ruth Hernandez, I, I have a master's in higher education. I am always an, uh, I, I am an English teacher as well. And I have a bachelor degree of English and French. Well, somebody can help me with the thought of today. The sorry day. What did you say? Can you? Read the thought for today. Education is not the learning on facts, but the training of the mind to think. What do you understand about this? Let me see. Remember that formal education in the past always thought that the students were an empty thing that the teachers has to fill with knowledge, okay, mm -hmm. or facts. Now, mm -hmm. uh, Albert Einstein said that education is not that. He was all, uh, uh, thinking on something more about education. And he said that is the training of the mind to think. So we are supposed to help the students to unlock their mind and started to think by themselves not just getting facts from the teacher, okay? Okay. I, I love how this man thinks. Okay. Now, it, in the platform, you can see the, the objectives, but I like to, uh, to present them also here at, at the PPT. And sorry, sometimes my computer thinks that she's a smartphone and 
Even when I write it well, it changes. <laughs> and sometimes I have not the chance to, to check it, but here it, it's supposed to be lecture and not lectura. Okay. Now, I, I, I will uh, share this PPT with you at the WhatsApp group. I hope all of you are already in the WhatsApp group. Are you there? ¿Ya están todos en el, en el yes. grupo de WhatsApp? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, I do. Yes, okay. I will share the WhatsApp link here at the chat. Okay. Because sometimes... The people is not there. This this information you already have it in, in your in your mail, okay? Yes. Yes. But I, I am uh, I am sharing here at the chat okay. the 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 link for the WhatsApp for the ones that are not in the WhatsApp group yet. Okay, now. Someone else can help me with the objective, please. A volunteer. Can I try it? Okay. Uh, lesson, lesson audio tip. By the end of this lecture, participants will be able to describe problems with past participles as adjectives and with nouns. Okay, thank you very much. Now, describing problems. Uh, have you seen the first video, the introductory video? No. Well, in my case, no. No? Uh, someone that has seen it or watch it? Yes, is from the problem in the hotel. Uh huh. Problems in the hotel. What happened there? Uh, there is the reason. Uh, the reason. Have you noticed what happened first? It's not only the problems in the room, but I guess it's, that the, the, the biggest problem that man has in the hotel is the, man is very is the young man, because he's distracted yes. always. And he I, doesn't care about anything <laughs> because <laughs> he was not supposed to give room 12 because room 12 was a mess. <laughs> and he gave the, the guests, room 12 that it, 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 the man goes to the um he said warehouse to the warehouse to mm -hmm. buy some some material in order to fix room room 12 mm -hmm. but right. the the young man gave then gave the, the guests the wrong room. And what their were condition all the problems is in there? work? Yes, the, the window is broken. The don't, window was broken. Was broken and done. The, uh, the control the control for, for the air conditioning also. 
right? Isn't water? There is no water. Uh -huh. And the electricity always. Uh, uh, is, uh, yes, the lamp. The lamp is, is not working either. So it was a mess. Then the, the people didn't stay there. <laughs> <Sure>. <laughs> no. It, when when we finish here, you can go and watch the, the video, the ones that, are, that haven't seen it yet. And okay. also work as much as you can. Uh, we will be here working, uh, uh, reinforcing what is in the, What is in the in the platform? In the platform, yes. I am seeing many problems here. I I wait. I will change it right now because later I will forget. As, as I told you, my computer thinks that she is a smartphone. You know what smartphones do. You, you do the things well and it changes. Okay, now, much better. Sorry. Now, describing problems. It, we can describe problems with past participles as adjectives. And here we have, the jacket Teacher. lining. Yes. Good evening. I have a question. Yes. Past participles. I forgot what it's past participles. Past participles are <laughs> what kind of, 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 of the verbs when you are learning the verbs, you have the simple form, you have um, a, the, past. the past and past participle. Ah, yes, Remember? in the verb. Yes, um, the past participle is in the verb. Then the verb in the first is term. Term. Yes. The jacket. I I, 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 okay. I, have, I have a place it in a different color so you can see them better. Um, so, okay. okay. And we okay. tend to use the past participles after the verb to be, okay? In this case, okay. in this case, in this we case. also can mm -hmm. use past participles after the verb had or has, but that is mm -hmm. uh, when we are working with the present perfect, okay? But in this case, okay. since we are using this as adjectives, the, in this case, the verb, the, these verbs, uh, uh -huh. the ones in, in red, are using as adjectives. Okay, the main verb in the in the in the, in the sentence is the verb to the be. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. the verb is the verb to be. But here we are using the past participles as adjectives. Se lo estamos ocupando Asai. como un adjetivo. Yes. It, it is describing what is happening with something. Okay? Sí. Sí. Remember yes. that yes. the adjective is the part of the sentence that tells it that modifies a noun. Okay? Uh, Está modificando mm -hmm. un nombre. The, the jacket li lining is turned. That means that it is. Yes. 
¿ok? Mm, ok. Está roto, está roto, ¿ok? But it's the, an object. The tabletop is damaged. The tabletop is damaged. That vase is shipped. My pants are stained. Her sunglasses are a little scratched. This new aquarium is leaking. In this case, here is not in past participle, is in present continuous. Okay? Mm -hmm. It's leaking. Mm -hmm. Okay? Thank uh, you. Uh, any, any other questions about how we use past participles as adjectives? No. Acuérdense que el adjetivo es la parte de la oración que modifica el nombre. Entonces, este, está diciendo que de lo que estamos hablando, cómo es que está, o sea, su... Que, que, ¿Cuál es el problema que tiene? We are describing problems. We are describing problems here. And the problem is that is torn, that is damaged that is shipped, that is stained, or scratched, okay? Any questions about that? Preguntas? No. Okay. Now, let's continue. Now, in this case, we are using nouns. Okay, to describe the same problems. So the same problems can be described with adjectives or with nouns, okay? If you see in this case, we don't say turn, but we say a tear, a tear or a hole. Then we say some damage, a ship, a stain, a few scratches, and a leak, okay? If you notice, it's the same thing, but in this case, we are using past participles to describe the problem. And in this case, we are using Nouns. Do you understand the difference? Hello? Yes, teacher. Yes. yes? Okay. Now, uh, someone who read number, the, the, the first sentences. The Me, first teacher. line. Uh huh. It has a tear in it. Mm -hmm. And the there other is, one? There is a hole in it. Okay. Now, someone else, number two? There is some damage on the top. Okay, thank you. Someone else, the next one? Me. There is there a is chip. chip. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay, go, go ahead. ahead. There's a chip in it. Okay. They have a stain on, on them. On them, on them. And someone else? Uh, me, teacher. There are okay. a few scratches on them. Okay, thank you. Next one. And it has a lick in it. Okay, thank you very much. Describing problems. Past participle, something is torn or with noun has a tear in it. Here we are saying the same problem, okay? Describing with past participle and describe with with noun. 
You can see the difference. Now, the structure with the past participle is subject plus verb to be plus past participle. My dress is torn. This is the structure. You can say, uh, you can make uh, uh, with the same structure, different sentences describing different problems. Okay. Now the structure with nouns, subject plus have plus the noun. My dress has a stain on it. There is or there are plus noun. There is a stain on okay. it. Okay. In this case, you can use have or has or there is, there are plus the noun in you are describing the problems, okay? Now we have these problems. A chip in a mug, a tear on a pair of jeans, and a scratch on a CD. Uh, we were uh, shopping with my with my son one of these days. And he looked at the at the jeans and he said they are already uh, with tears on it. And I said yes. On my time, if you find something like that in a in a in a store, you say it's useless. You cannot buy it. But nowadays. You, if you don't find uh, tears on your jeans, they are not good for you. <laughs> the times change, okay? Now yeah. I can wear my jeans as much as I want, and when they are already tear, I can uh, sell them for a better price. <laughs> oh. Now, uh, can you make your own sentences using the chip and a mug, either with an, an adjective or with a noun? Please. Volunteers. Me, teacher, the first. Okay. Chip. Mm -hmm. I cook. Um. <laughs> Your cup. My cup is chipped. I don't know. Uh -huh. I get, My cup is I chipped. Get. Okay, thank chipped. you. Uh -huh. Somebody can do it with a noun. Uh, chipped astillada. Yes. There is a chip in my mug. It, it, this is called mug instead of cup because it's bigger. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Someone else? Uh, remember, these activities are from the video and you can write them r right in the bottom. Have you ever done, uh, done that? Ya lo han hecho? ¿Ya saben cómo hacerlo? Yo voy escribiendo, teacher. Uh -huh. eh, ¿Dónde? En el recuadro de abajo. Ajá, aquí en el recuadro. Uh -huh. Entonces aquí eh, eh, se pone añadir una, una publicación. Entonces este, les sugiero que pongan su nombre primero, como para que se sepa que, o sea, aquí va, añade una, una publicación. Entonces aquí donde dice título, ahí pongan su nombre para que lo que usted vaya escribiendo aquí se sepa que lo escribió usted. Ok. ¿Verdad? 
Entonces aquí pongan su nombre donde dice título, ponen su nombre y después contestan aquí eh, lo que se les ha dejado en, en, en el video. ¿verdad? Es que hay gente que no sabe cómo hacerlo. Entonces yo siempre pregunto. ¿Qué? Now, somebody with number three? My CD is mm -hmm. scratch. Okay. And what about uh, somebody to do it with adjective, with, with noun? Jefferson, can you do it with a noun? I don't know. It can be, I can use my CD because it has a scratch. It has a scratch. Or there is a scratch in my CD. There is a scratch in my CD. Could be. Okay. What about uh, number five here? Uh, a pair of jeans. Sofia? Yes, teacher. Uh, can you do? I oh, know you already have done the chip. Ah, yes? the chip. Okay. Yes. Francisco I Ernesto, can you, can you help us with the, t with the jeans? Uh, for yeah. example, my, 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 my jeans is is tear. My jeans are tear. Oh, are tear. Okay. No, it, it, it's not are tear, but are torn. Remember oh. that it has to be in past participle. Okay. Okay. Are Thank tier. you. Now, we are going to work in the platform because we had the check the knowledge check, okay? Uh, the ones that already have done this, help us. And if you haven't done it, you can open your platform and work on it right now. Si no lo han hecho todavía, pueden abrir la plataforma y trabajar en él. Yo no puedo abrir la plataforma. No ha podido entrar a la plataforma. Yo creo que no está activada. Como no. O, la... o solo la mía. Dicen que la activaron desde el viernes. No, no le... Desde luego que usted está aquí es porque ya le llegó el mensaje. Sí, sí. Vale, entonces con Pero el... ahora intenté entrar y no. Como es... que no está activa. Este, permítame. Saber por qué. No sé si los demás han intentado. Sí, hay gente que ya estuvo trabajando. Este, ya sí, sí, me sí. ganaron. Ah, vale. Sí, 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 bueno. Yo la acabo de revisar. Ah, ah pues tal vez ¿Y puedo ya entrar? No puedo entrar. Voy a ver. Sí, sí, yo sí pude entrar. Ok. Ay, ya me ganaste. Hmm. Este, le voy a poner el, el, ¿cómo se llama? El URL de la plataforma. Aquí en el chat también. Aunque usted debe de tenerlo. ¿Verdad? Pero in, intente ingresar ahorita, a ver si puede. Me y si, y si en, no, me... y si no en, el, en el grupo de WhatsApp, este, eh, informe su problema, porque ahí siempre ¿Ya? entra eh, un, un técnico. Sí, ahí es un técnico, porque me aparece en negrito, no me aparece azul, no puedo entrar. 
ustedes no se lo han habilitado. Sí, no sí pero si ya le llegó, ya le llegó la, la, la carta de invitación, o sea, el, el email, este debería de estar habilitado. Entonces, debería. Este, eh, eh, dígales que no se lo han habilitado, que si le hacen el favor de habilitarse. ¿Verdad? Sí, para que, para que no sea atrás. Eso Ajá, lo hacen rápido, pues, ¿sí? pero es, escríbales sí, ahí sí. en el WhatsApp. A, a, la, la, la señorita que nos escribió hoy temprano, ¿verdad? Ah, a, sí, a ella sí. escríbale y dígale que no le han habilitado su, su plataforma. Pero de todos modos, sí, este, sí. No, no, do, do you have a, a notebook right, uh, right there? Tiene un cuaderno. Yes, I have a... Para que vaya escribiendo las respuestas, porque ahorita lo vamos a ir haciendo. Oh, okay. ¿Verdad? Entonces, para que ya las tenga listas uh -huh. cuando usted entre a la plataforma y le sea más fácil. Ok. Now, uh, someone yes. uh, who already had done this, alguien que ya lo haya hecho. ¿Ya lo hicieron o no lo han hecho? No yet. Ajá. Pero lo vamos a hacer. <risa> ok. Es más, si quieren, me, si quieren me van dictando. Lo voy haciendo y lo revisamos entre todos. Ajá. Lo que no sé es si lo tengo que escribir todo o solamente la respuesta. Ok. Y... ¿Están de acuerdo con eso? Yeah. Yes. Ok. Now, could we have another water pitcher? This one. Is. Leaking. Ok. The table looks pretty dirty. The good. Teacher. Uh -huh. The second one, the bird leaking, it has to be in the past Paris perform. Yes, remember that uh, uh, this was the one with the. That we see here. Here is an exception to the rule. In this case, leaking is in present continuous form. Always. Yes, when when you use leak instead mm -hmm. of put of putting it with ed, you use it with ing. Okay. It's an exception to the rule. Uh -huh. Okay. 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 Well, the good is past two. This has to be crutch, no? 
It's not S, but C. Mm. Así sería, ¿verdad? Es crash. Crash, no es rush. I think so. We are missing a letter S. Crash. Scratch. Ah, scratch. Here is missing the C and, and I miss the S. Scratch. Okay. Now, the waiter needs a new shirt. The ones he's wearing. Turn. Has, oh, it's, it's turn. It's turn. Okay. Period. Could you bring me another cup of coffee? This cup is ship. Okay. Point. Now the walls really need painting and the ceiling is the match. Teacher, yes. In, num in number number five, don't you need to put the this cup, the war this in the first this cup is. I was uh, writing just that because sometimes they are asking just for the answer for the thing that is missing. It, I, I didn't know how they are working now. So I, I wrote it that way, but let's see. Let's check. Well, let's see. See, you don't have to write a, this one. The beginning, I Just it's leaking, okay? Then teacher, we only have to put the the part, only the answer with the part, with yes. the verb. Sorry, with the adjective or with the noun? With the adjective or with the noun. Okay, let's see now. Okay. Now, uh, each of you, 
will read uh, the question and the answer, okay? But um, we will see, we will do it this way. I will tell a name, that person will read the question and the answer and will tell a name. Who's next, okay? Who will read number two, for example, okay? Now, number one, uh, Rosa Torres, can you do it, please? Of course. Uh, number one, right? Yes. Uh, the full sentence or only? It, 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 both. This one and this one. Okay. This table tablecloth isn't very clean. It has a stain on it. Okay. Thank you very much. Who's next? You're welcome. Eh, de sus compañeros, ¿a quién va a nombrar? Que siga con el número dos. Uh, Francisco López. Ok, Francisco. No, number two. Yes, please. Could we have another water picture? This one. Is leaking. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, tell me who's next. Mr. Francisco. Jefferson. Okay, Jefferson. Number three, the table looks pretty dirty. The wood is scratched too. Okay, thank you. Who's next? Jose Peña. Okay, number four. The waiter needs a new shirt. The one he's wearing is torn. Okay, thank you. Who's Sofia next? Calderon. Sofia. Hola. Hello. Number five. The number six is teacher. No, number five. Or add five. Could you bring me another cup of coffee? This cup is cheap. Okay, thank you. It's cup. Huh? Cup of coffee, cup of coffee cup of coffee. Okay, thank you. This cup. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hey, who's next? Mm, quiero ver. <laughs> es que no, no los puedo ver, teacher. Ay, ¿qué está haciendo por teléfono? Sí. Ah, okay. Pues, Rafael Dabu. <laughs> okay, Rafael Dabu. <laughs> okay. The walls really need painting and the ceiling is damaged. Okay, damaged. 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 Okay, thank you very much. Now we have a listening exercise. Okay. Uh, have you done it or not? ¿Ya lo habían escuchado? No. No. Sí. No. Vaya, este, voy a intentar ponérselos aquí. Voy a ver si se escucha. Porque algunas veces da problemas. Ok. Este, pongamos atención. Me avisan si se puede escuchar. ¿Lo pudieron escuchar? 
No. No, no teacher. Bueno, mm -hmm. Le voy a compartir en el WhatsApp este el listening y me dicen si lo pueden escuchar. Mm. Uh -huh. Voy a ver si se puede. Yo creo que no se va a escuchar. Traten de ver si se puede bajar ahí. Si no, lo voy a poner desde aquí. No lo pudieron abrir, ¿verdad? Sí, no, because we are on Zoom at the same time. Vale. Vamos a ver si aquí se escucha. ¿Lo escucharon ahí? No. 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 Voy a ver si con esto funciona. Tengo una pregunta. But there's something wrong with the lock. I can't get it to close properly. Let me see. Oh, we can, we can hear it. it. Yes, I see right. what you mean. The lock seems to be jammed or something. No problem. I'll get you another one. Sorry about that. Two. No, no lo escuchan, ¿verdad? No, no, no. no. Maybe the weather. Este, <risa> los que pueden entrar a, a la plataforma, ¿lo pueden escuchar ahí? Yes, I can. Intenten, por favor. Can you listen to me? Yes, teacher. Ajá. Entonces ahora voy a ver si con esto.
Listen to three customers return an item they purchased. What's the problem? Take notes. Then complete the chart. One. Bought this briefcase here last week, but there's something wrong with the lock. I can't get it to close properly. Let me see. Yes. Yeah. I see what you mean. The lock seems to be jammed or something. No problem. I'll get you another one. Ni así no lo pueden escuchar tampoco. Es que intenté ponerlo con el Bluetooth. No funciona, ¿verdad? Sí se escucha. ¿Cómo no? Hello. Yes, we can. Yes, teacher, we can work on. Hear me. Yes. Me escuchan. Okay. No, no se pudo. Yes, we could. We could. Ustedes sí lo pudieron oír. Yes, yes teacher, we can. can. ¿Dónde? Ahí en su, yes. cada quien en su plataforma. No, in the last one. In the last one. The last ah. way that you did. Your microphone. Ah, le funcionó. Yes. yes, when you were using Bluetooth. Okay. Entonces lo voy a volver a poner. Ok. Vaya, me avisan. Hoy sí. Hoy sí se escucha. No. 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 <risa> Permítanme. Hoy sí lo escuchan. No. Hello. Can you hear me? Yes. No. Teacher, uh, I don't know, but if you want, we can do the other exercise and then do the, this exercise with the listening. Me avisan si se escucha, por favor. Can you hear me? Yes. Ok. Eh, me avisan si lo escuchan. Ok. No. No, we cannot hear you. There's no audio.
We cannot hear you, teacher. Teacher, can, you can check if you don't have turn on the Bluetooth. Uh, it could be the problem. Can you hear me now? Yes. Ok. ¿Y, y escucharon el, 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 el audio otra vez? No. 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 Es que, But, pero en un no. momento me dijeron que sí lo escuchaban, ¿verdad? Sí. Bien. Quisiera saber cómo es que pueden escucharlo. <risa> <risa> sí, porque si funcionó una vez. Lástima que no me avisaron cuando funcionó para haberlo dejado así. Bueno. Este. So, uh, supposedly there are three people with problems that want to return something, okay? But now, Cuando puedan lo escuchan ustedes y este Now, uh, the time is over. I will try to to do something with the sound for next class. Okay. I okay. will turn two I will turn on two computers maybe that way we can listen to the to the things Sorry? that you need to listen to. So, uh, work on your platform. The ones that cannot get into the platform, please write a report on WhatsApp. In, in order to have your your platform and work on it. And remember that we will be checking all the uh, activities here. And that way we know that you have it right. And this is, this is um, just to make sure that you are working well, okay? Don't okay. worry, I know you are a good students and it sends a lot. I am happy to have you here. And Thank you. you you should continue doing your your best and I will be there for you to help you. Uh, you can contact me through WhatsApp also in the in the group. Write in the group okay. any problem that you had. If I am not there uh, any of your uh, classmates can help you as well okay okay thank you very much see you tomorrow remember you. we have classes from monday to thursday thank you. at this okay. schedule bye bye see bye you. bye good night tomorrow have a nice good evening bye bye, bye. bye. good night